Christine Brown earned a reputation of being the favorite star from Sister Wives. It happened when she finally made up her mind about leaving polygamist Cody Brown and moving away from Flagstaff. Over the last two seasons, viewers cheered Christine on for her bold move and the courage to prioritize herself and the kids. Then, everyone was over the moon when Christine not only introduced her boyfriend but also got married to him. But it looks like she has started to face backlash now. Her streak of garnering love and appreciation from the audience has come to an end now. They found some fault in her latest pictures and have started to come at her for overfiltering them. It has been a while since Christine became the most popular cast member from Sister Wives. It happened after she decided to part ways with Cody. Soon, his other spouses followed, and now Robin is the only one married to him. Apart from this, everyone would love Christine's raw and honest personality. But her latest post left a bad taste in everyone's mouth. While promoting her Plexus products, Christine uploaded some photos. In it, viewers could see visible wrinkles on her forehead. Strangely, the rest of her face was smooth. Due to this, they began trolling her for excessively editing and photoshopping her face. While well, Christine quickly took down the photos. Well, a Sister Wives fan was able to screenshot Christine's post. They have circulated the pictures on Reddit. Over there, viewers were much kinder to her. While they were okay with her experimenting with the filters, they tried to remind her it was unnecessary as she is beautiful just the way she is. They wished for her not to get used to such a thing. Christine is now just a happy married woman but wishes to expand her empire. Her wedding to David Woolley was the stuff of dreams, she didn't want to be recognized that way. The Sister Wives star decided to reveal her new business venture to the audience. She said how she and David had purchased a new property in Moab, Utah, with the intention of turning it into an Arab. She gave everyone a tour of the same and said they'd be able to book the place in March. But a new detail from her rental made everyone feel weird. That's because Christine captured herself with paper cutouts with the rest of the plural families, including Cody Brown. She wanted to decorate her arm with posters from the TLC show, which had Cody too. Viewers thought it was improper as she had started this business with David E., her current husband. Moreover, viewers also called Christine out for setting unreasonably high prices for her rental. Many Redditors admitted that they wouldn't be able to afford their stay at such a place. However, Janelle Brown leaves her RV life. In July 2022, Janelle revealed that she would be stepping away from her RV life. The Sister Wives star explained that her daughter, Savannah, struggled to live in the motor home, especially during the summer. Janelle has also been back and forth to her fifth-wheel trailer since last year. But she spends the majority of her time at her rental house in Arizona. The mother of six likes to spend nights in her children's houses as well, especially with Maddie. Some Redditors discuss the possible reason why Robin doesn't seem to want Janelle's RV on Coyo Pass. During the past seasons, Cody mentioned that Janelle should ask permission first before parking her recreational vehicle on the property. But the poster, who claimed to drive past the Brown family's land, said that Robin Brown's house was so close to the Coyo Pass land. Many Sister Wives fans were also surprised that Christine's house was just a few blocks from Robin's, but Cody wasn't able to visit them regularly. Janelle has been focusing more on her well-being. She previously shared clips and pictures from her trip to the Dominican Republic with Savannah. The Sister Wives star also took to social media recently to share her healthy fish and egg recipe. Janelle Brown also revealed in an interview that she may look into dating again after 10 years. However, Cody's ex-wife clarified that she's still open to polygamy due to the freedom and independence she gets from the lifestyle. I think it was a good fit for me. I don't even know what a monogamous relationship would be like. If that works out, great. I'm open to plural marriage, but I don't know if there's a lot of men who can pull it off. Hello lovely viewers, welcome to my channel. I am Jenny, hope your day is so well. If you like the video, 